one of the really nice features that Final Cut Pro has, and I have not found that in other software, it's the ability to export multiple clips at once. For example, here I have one big media file, and that means it includes parts that I do not want to include in the final clip. I want to cut the big clip into multiple little clips so that when I need to use them, I only need to get the parts that I need instead of trying to work through the entire big file. To do that, I'm going to bring down this entire file, bring it down here, and then click OK. Next, I'm going to go through the entire clip and only keep the ones that I want. For example, this is part that I do want. Here I have five individual little clips. What I want to do is to export all five of them at once as a media file by itself. So our next step is to click on the first one. This is the one that I do want as one file. Then right click and then click on new compound clip or you can use the shortcut. Give it a name. I'll say clip one, cover page, then click OK. Over here, we see the file right here. Then I'm going to do the same for the next four files. OK, for the last two, I just want to combine them. So select both clips and then create a compound clip. Okay, now over here, I see four individual clips. To export all four of them at once, select them by left click on the first one, hold down shift key, click the last one, release shift key once you have select all the individual files. Then click on file. And up here, we see an option that says share four clips. And then choose the export format. I'm going to be using the high efficiency video format. So I'm going to click on that. And notice that here we have four clips to share. And I'm going to go ahead and click next. Select the folder where you want the final clips to go. Then click on share. And up here, we'll see that it is starting to export. And as it exports, the clips pops up. And then if I go to this folder, I see those four individual clips. This is a feature that I really like. I hope this video is helpful if you use Final Cut Pro.